Hello there everyone and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover, in which uh, we're looking at quite a lack of faction force right now, but we are currently at war with the good old Axis still. Of course, the Finns, but we're seizing foreign enterprise right now as we talk. I think you were from yesterday, but what foreign investors have been quite useful for us in enterprises they established would be a much better place to Polish hands. That also upset the original owners, but it's a necessary act of patriotism. In which I figured, you know what, Poland, why not? Now, I'm not sure really what else we can do for this campaign. I really don't want to fight the Allies. The Allies are... Well, they're the Allies. But, for me at least, I'm feeling not allied. Uh, please don't try to kill us. So I'm feeling like we should maybe, maybe, maybe we should go fight Russia. We go fight Russia. Um, well, if I help fight the Japanese, Allies, the Japanese. We'll take out Russia at the very least for this campaign and uh, call it a campaign, I guess. You know, why not? Why not? Give us some sort of end goal, some sort of target to fight for. Of course, we do probably want to invite, invade these guys as well. Um, I, I, I definitely do not want to have to get navally invaded again, but it looks like if we have to, you know, we'll have to. So, it is what it is if we just so have to. We're doing quite well against Finns, like very, very well. What are the casualties like? Almost half a million. What, well, Finland? We delivered 65,000 casualties almost. The only reason we can't win here is because National Spain is giving us a run for our money, but, you know, whatever. Um, yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, we'll see what happens with those guys. But yeah, uh, would y'all like to go down here? If you just encircle them, that make it so much easier for everybody. And if you want, you go right here too. And cut these guys off in the north. So that'd be pretty useful for us as well. But after season four in Enterprises, the National Commonwealth, the old Commonwealth was an empire of Poles, presiding over great lands of peoples. With Lithuania in her hands, the Polish Empire is reborn once more. Might as well. Might as well. It is 43, of course, everybody. A bit more construction speed, shall we? Oh, we shall. Ah, please get us those cores. For the love of God, get us those cores. And just in case, start building up some infrastructure. Not infrastructure. Um, some radar, because that would be very, very beneficial for us. Uh, get a thing of air bases, and then grab at least one more milli for us. I'm sure we could use it. I'm sure we could. Toad rocket artillery, you can make it as well, because if you really want to. Oh, what are we lacking? Are we lacking gun? No, we almost have a million guns. So I'm going to assume planes are ones that we really need. We're not going to use uh, pack bombers for this campaign, so I don't even want to see them. Screw it, naval bombers, I don't want to see you either. Unless we make them ourselves. Rocket artillery is nice and all. Um, yeah. We have a lot of, a lot of equipment, actually. Kind of nice. And get a thing of refineries, too. It's good to get two. Nice. Very good. Very good stuff. Ooh, we lost a couple subs. That sucks, though. There you go, there you go. How are we doing with this stuff? Looking pretty okay-ish. Well, we're not winning as, we, as much as we could have been. We could be. But, oh, it's good supplies are just so god-awful up here. There are literally no like, supply bases. Which sucks. If you can, go like here, maybe. And then do this as well. Uh, it flip-flops. Sometimes it does well, sometimes it doesn't want to do well here. Hmm. Yeah, don't worry about that one. Go in there if you can. Yep, yeah, nope, I guess not. Another horse division? Might as well. I mean, can we even push down here at all? If not, no, just hold. Just hold. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Do we have any uh, logistic companies on our horses? Yes, we do. We already have the logistics, so... Not sure what else we can do about that. They have a little bit of supply up there as well, which is not bueno for us. Let's finish off the fins, get another railway gun, because I love railway guns. And then see what happens. Hopefully we can build this up pretty darn quickly. And then the Civil War, no, we could... Ooh, more phalangism? Yes. War bonds would be bad. We don't really need that, though, too much. Reform the Commonwealth, close that one out. Um, Nothing really against... Huh, some groups that I really wanted to oppress stuff against. Whatever. Um, Yeah. Rubber? We could really use more rubber. Oh, they're actually trying to push us out, huh? You know, this kind of sucks. It really sucks fighting through here. They take no supply issues. They have literally no supply issues. Why? As we're trying to build up our own bases here. This is kind of, no. No, I'm sorry, but no. You, There's absolutely no way you can win right there. No, I refuse to lose that one. Um, Go right there too, if you can. How do they have so much supply here? Where, where's the supply base? I mean, you have this up here, but that's not... Is that part of it? I guess it's up there, but still. This is dumb. Oh, I, doing Finland like this is not that smart. Okay. We're going to nearly invade, maybe, if possible. Mm. 
If that's the case. Picking you out. So, we'll do it like this. We'll invade Allen and Gotland first, maybe? Oh, nah. Nah, screw it. Go from Stockholm to Turku. Oh, we can't. Oh my god, we can't even naval invade. Are you kidding me? Bro. Bro. That is stupid. We don't have any naval invasion stuff up set up. Man, I mean, it makes sense, but oh my gosh. That is so not cool. Italy is getting invaded again. God dang it. Where? Well, I'm glad I got you out of here, but still. Just don't lose the areas that we're building up these naval bases. Or these supply bases, really. Because they're not taking enough attrition. Honestly, if they... If they how are they taking only 4%? That's ridiculous. That's such BS. Did they take the supply base we were just trying to make? Oh my god, they did. Oh my god, this is so dumb. How? How? They have no supply down here either. How? Well, they're gonna die. Well, at least we have that Polish Empire's rebirth. At least that's nice. Um, switch operative captured. I guess we will follow just international. I read this one yesterday, so if you want to read this one again, please go right ahead. How did we lose? What the heck? Oh my god, the AI has got to be cheating here. How do we suffer so much supply issues, and yet they don't suffer anything? They got one supply base. They, that's literally it. Up here, they got literally nothing else. Actually, we have a supply base right here. Look at that support. That's actually really nice up there. If anything, let's boost that one up so we get some more supply through here, and then maybe through here as well. Maybe. That is stupid. And they're not suffering any sort of supply issues. I mean, come on. Seriously, bro? When you take that towel, there's nothing they can do, right? Just get in there. Get in there if you can. What? Did we win? Okay. Oof. Would have been a little more pissy if... Uh, oh my god, are you kidding me? Bro, seriously. You're gonna get in circle if you do that, so don't do that. Why don't we even have command power? Great superiority, somewhat. Night vision's good. Uh, you know what, screw it. We're gonna go with this one. I don't care if it's 300 days ahead of time. We need it. We literally need it right now, so. That's Russia. Seriously. It's, what was it, like 4% maybe max for them? Hmm. I guess that's nice. More, yes. Good. Hopefully they don't get sunk. Lancer. And just start chucking torpedoes out if you possibly can. So after this one, we gotta go research some naval invasion stuff. Because this is, this is just garbage. We have a lot of manpower now. I like it. I like all this manpower. Um, usually there's one where you can build up more conscription stuff. Or not conscription stuff, but like roads? Wh why don't we have that? They already use it. I might have already done it, actually. Hmm. Do we have any transport planes? We can send supply. Yeah, let's, maybe that's the way we can do it. Let's send some tra uh, supply through the air. That could work, right? Yeah, that could work. Totally work. Actually, this will help out as well, just a little bit. It's not much. It'll give you just a little bit more supply. I know it gets more fuel capacity as well, but just a little bit more supply through here as well. So, uh, we've lost quite a few guys. I mean, I'm ready to kill off all the Spanish people. It's not even funny, man. I'm really annoyed with these guys. But, god dang it. After this one, invite the Lowlands. More than 20 fascist support out of this world started. Invite us to the flash, flashist, fascist international. I already took out Luxembourg too. Subs, even better subs would be very nice. Go level four, go four, four, four. Radar, not bad. Pretty good sub if I do say so myself. Bing, bong, bong. Ah, just get rid of that one, it's fine. There you go. Even more. 
Nice. Construction five. Grab some of that. That'll be good. Come on, you wanted to attack us, so. Uh, okay. Are they still popping people out here? Huh. Very odd, but okay. Sure, why not? We're just literally just waiting for the supply base to be made, which is stupid. Oh, it takes so long to make... Why is supply okay now? What the heck is wrong with this? Is it because we made supply point... Or the supply base? I think it is. I think that's because it is. Man, supply in these some of these areas is just so bad. I mean, it makes sense. Don't get me wrong. It does make sense, but it just, it's so annoying. This whole supply system thing can sometimes be super, super annoying. Oh. Especially when you try to max out all like supply you already have. Uh, support American Phalangists? Uh, oh, wait. Invite Greece. Control the Bosporus. Oh, no. Greece isn't really doing so well. So, control the Bosporus? The remaining alliance is utterly meaningless if we are powerless to move armies and navies through the Bosporus Strait. Turkey is a vital strategic interest to our nation, and they must be convinced to join us. Never mind. Italian alliance? The Italian government has made it no secret that they are an enemy to the ideals of self-determination that the Mean Wars represents, but with the appropriate challenges to both or changes to both the Polish and Italian general, general governments. We may be able to align them with our vision for the future of Europe? Uh, probably not. The North Sea? Before we can even begin to consider swaying the neutral powers of the North to join our alliance, we must lay the groundwork on the global diplomatic stage. We must make the Northern powers aware of our eagerness to cooperate and send Joseph back in a silver tongue to the Nordic countries to convince them that the many benefits of aligning themselves with the Mean Wars. Well, I don't know about that now, but, you know, maybe... Maybe last time. Huh. There you go. Did we... Oh, my God. Are you kidding me, bro? Alright. Let's go. We're going out. Seriously? Are you flipping kidding me? Cut him off. You're not moving, you piece of garbage. Force the attack. You're literally, you're literally all just gonna die here. Like, I, I'm sick of this. I'm sick of these supply issues and whatnot. Kill them all off. Go here to here. Kill them off. Every single last one of them. These guys are so annoying to fight. God, I hate Finland. Good. Kill them off. They kill Fire Division. We kill them. We kill all of them off. Convoys die. Good. Allies are doing a okay. Good. Kill them all off. Every single last one of them has to die. Help him out. Where are you going? Oh, no, 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 son. You go up there. There you go. That's better. We lost, what, half a million? Oh, the Finns should not have pissed me off, man. Oh, what's over here? Anything? No? Spur tactic? Oh, we can wait for that. Um, what do we have? Infiltration assault? That's not bad. Spur tactic's good. You. There you go. Yeah, we could do that. Go in here too. Oh, you wanted to escape. Well, you should have let my horses escape earlier. But now you're all dead. Quite literally all dead. And now you're just going to ride the coast all the way down. To Helsinki. How many divisions do they got? They got five divisions left. Good. Every last one of them's got to die. And we are on this one too, so... Yep, they're probably going to reject us, and that's fine with me. About the Baltics? A little late for that. And about the Lowlands? The phalangism is on the political fringes in the Benelux. A modern investment of time and resources could see them becoming mainstream enough to make an alliance with those countries feasible. Oh, you don't like it when we try to take you out? Oh, go suck a fat one, Finland. Um, war bonds, Benelux, South America. A hundred people. If we could get Brazil with us, that'd be really cool. Kind of doubt we could get them, though, but we'll try. Because the Benelux is pretty fascist already. They're... 51%, which is nice. Um, you three join there. Come on. And then you three just join. Well, we're using you the most, so you must do that one. There you go. There you go. Go straight down, son. Straight down the vipurity. Nice. Well... Actually, you guys go right there. And there was one, a couple comments saying that we should make puppets estates out of uh, the people we're taking out. We could, yeah. And then uh, our current leader is was pretty much Demowski's successor. So our current leader is Bolski. This Bolski, Bolsaw guy. Well, apparently, he was like Demowski's like successor. So I don't know that. It's kind of cool. But do I hate the Finns or what right now? I hate them with such a burning passion. Um, 
what is this? Oh, okay, I might literally just force the allies to go to war with Spain. Cause I, this is annoying. I don't want to deal with this anymore. I really don't. What the heck is this? Are you killing them? Please kill them. This is really awkward. Uh, how close are we getting this one done? Eh, actually, probably could set it up right now. All right, so one, two, three. One, two, three. That's honestly huge. all you really need to get these guys here and force the attack into them both areas. Nice. All right, so now I'm actually going to have to move you around. Uh, you guys, I don't really want to stop doing that. How many do we need for this? 51. So really, uh, there you go. 49. Yeah, that should be good enough. So you guys will be fine. You guys come back over here. And horse boys, we'll do that first. Get some more subs on here. I could do that. I'm going to try to go gotten land. The best of our abilities. Get this one done. By the lowlands, do the North Sea. Tank stuff, I'm also grab that one, even though we're not really going to be using it very much. Whatever. Um, get some stuff down here in Italy as well, because you could really use some extra radar. And some more rubber, too. That'd be good. That'd be very good. Put a lot of roads up already. Uh, supply, we're going to need something here, too. There you go. Just in case. You never know. So let's invade first, and then we'll try to help invade Russia, and then we'll call it a campaign, maybe? Maybe? It's going to be really difficult, but whatever. If we can get the Benelux in with us, that'd be great. Alright, so you, one, two, three. Just do that. There you go. And there you go. And we'll invade whenever... We can! Ruxus Belgium accepts invitation to the Falanges International. Ruxus Belgium is excited to accept our offer to join the Falanges International. That's worth which we'll stand or fall together. No one can stand up against us? Well, nice. Oh, and Ruxus Belgium joins us. Alright, we are stronger together. Well, at least we got an ally, a little buddy with us, Leon de... You're not shouting. What did they do to our dude? Uh, are you sure that's Leon? Don't look like Leon to me. But right now, we sent, we put actually a lot of planes in the water here because we we're trying to sink every single Finnish, every single Swedish ship right around here. So, um, if that's the case, and we can actually get some outlets like that, maybe try to get Brazil with us, of course. Uh, we'll get some more planes done, get some more casts done. Uh, so we invade the Soviet Union, but we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Um, how about a little bit more? We got to get up to at least 40%. But I was going to take quite a while to get more fascist support around here. And maybe even Argentina as well. We'll see what happens, maybe. We'll see. Uh, up here. We're just shooting down planes. Just shooting them down like crazy. Uh, it helps us get more naval experience, which yeah, it's nice and all, but it is taking a while to get them done. Um, it does kind of suck, not going to lie. Uh, just waiting this long to get this stuff done. Turkmenistan's gone. Do we have anything else up here? Level 5, attack and defense. He's not that close to finishing that stuff off. The allies are still doing okay. They're not doing great up here, which does kind of suck. Um, yeah, I wish I wish we are doing just a little bit better. Of course, if we, if we join the war, of course, it would be better overall, but, you know, whatever. Um, can we just do it like this? I have for, for Russia's decrypted, which is nice. Go and put some soldiers on the line, see what we can do. See if we can maybe start opening them up a little bit more. That's a lot of manpower to kill off. A lot of divisions. Not a lot of equipment, though, which is good to see. I do want to see if we can able invade, though. Actually, we don't need that many divisions to invade, so... One, two, three, four, five. There you go. One, two... That'll give me four, two, three, four. And the Polish Finnish Pact. Alright, not bad. And we just finished off the North Sea. Support American Phalangists? Well, we probably want to wait for this one. Um, is there anything, nothing else right there? Plant East New Military Academy. I've read this one before, so if you read this one again, please go right ahead. Thank you. And I, I, we haven't done all that stuff to you, but, you know, whatever. We're still going to blow up a lot of enemy ships here. How is any of supremacy? Oh, you guys are where? You guys are down here? Good. You guys are up here, so then you guys are over here, too. Thank you. Uh, you are over here, too. Thank you. And you guys are up here, too. Cool. Thank you. Cool. Can we try an alien invade? We can try it. Might as well try it, right? Might as well. See what we can do. We'll force the attack, maybe. Uh, hopefully we do okay here. Force the attack, maybe. Do okay-ish. Can we duplicate you guys? And then do you guys immediately... You guys actually do this. You four just come here and do this. Do that, maybe. Now we're doing some serious damage. 30-some damage. Especially with force attack. And they're literally going to be just dying here. Nice. There we go. We got him. We got him. Woo! We got him, guys. 
Not bad. Could have been a lot worse. You guys go here and then do that too. All we need. Um, sure. Well, at least they're stuck in the war with us now. It's kind of nice. Uh, you three. Uh, there you go. If anything, actually, we might just send these guys back eventually too. Hopefully, Spain doesn't invade us again. But you know, you never know. Palermo. Honestly, we don't have that many naval bombers. Obviously, I deleted those naval bombers earlier that we did have, which was kind of stupid of me, but I don't really care. So, one, two, go up there. One, two, go down there. I like it, using a lot of casts. Horse boys doing okay? Yes, they are. You guys go and train yourselves anyways. Uh, prepare for the invasion. Uh, do we have any? Do we need any more supply bases anywhere around here? Supply is not great up there, so that's fine. Other than that, it looks okay. We've got some radar stations. We've got some... Uh, Air stations, air bases. We could probably use them right there. Oh, and we need an army up here as well. Oh, actually, that's fine. We can use these guys up here. Oh, that helps out too. That works. All right, not bad. Lost a couple things here and there, but the, get, using cast is not great. But it does help us a little bit in sinking enemy ships as well. Support the subs. That's what we're here for. Honestly, if you don't do this area, I'm kind of okay with that. Because you guys are down here. You guys are down there. You guys got. Either one of these two, three, two, there you go. You are up there, so that's fine right there. You guys are right there, that's fine right there. And you guys are up there, that's fine right there too. Only eight, that's not good. Bing bong. There you go. There you go. Level six, still not too bad. We get some Spanish stuff. Republic, or side preferred to them is done as well. Not too shabby. And I just hope to God that the allies don't come knocking on our door. That'd be quite bad, I'll be honest. I'll put on some more resistance in Finland. Oh god, kill the Finns off, please. There you go. And keep boosting up phalangism. Uh, someone else we're doing phalangism here too. Is it Peru? Oh yeah, we could get Peru with us. Maybe even Venezuela. Hmm. Argentina. Yeah, we're doing Argentina as well. Let's do Argentina. Argentina and Brazil. At least get one of those two in with us and that'd be great. Not bad. So can we invade now? We try it, yeah, yeah. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to us, yeah. Because they will have the, the Finnish navy here too, but hopefully they have no one here, so we can just throw you guys back onto here as well. Hello, yes, yes, yes. Hey, we did it! Nice job. There you go. And now we can just set and forget and don't have to think about it. We'll probably need more divisions anyways, but whatever. And go two more. I like having a lot of cavalry for this campaign. And go right there. Chubbies? There we go. Um, there we go. Ooh. There we go. Not bad. And more anti tank, maybe? Artillery? Good. That's fine. It's fine. Totally, totally, totally fine. Not really, but yeah, it's fine. Whatever. Uh, go ahead and do that, too. And I guess start just flying on Russia, maybe? Oh, actually, we should not have put those guys there because we saw this opened up. Hmm. But if we move fast enough, it won't really matter, will it? But it will still matter, so god dang it. My bad. She insisted. Let's grab some of that, too. Anything over here we really care about? Nope. They should do okay. Make sure we got enough planes for you guys. Uh, lower that by half and actually just send you to here. That'd be nice. And uh, there you go. I'll just give you one of you guys. And they do that too. That'd be nice. New Military Academy. If you want to read this one again, please go ahead. Go ahead just go through, straight to that. We could do planes, but I don't really feel like it yet. Oh, hello? I must be down here. Landing craft is nice. Uh, it is 44, which is kind of weird for us to be this late, but whatever. Um, I do apologize for being slightly rage earlier. You know, it happens. Um, nuclear reactors, maybe? Maybe, maybe not? Yes? No? Maybe yes, daddy so? Uh, we're done building stuff. Yeah, I don't believe that. We have plenty enough stuff to build around here, so. Plenty. Thank you. Down here, uh, all of Italy and Greece, pretty much. Give it guys a few more days to get over there where they ever need to be. Got plenty of radar around here. A lot of coverage. It's very good. 
Um, up with that, uh, do two here. Supply bases, we're going to need some more immediately. We're still building one up here anyways. Um, just in case, you can build one there too, because you can. Are we good to go? Actually, we'll probably need to just fight and go... For it. Oh, just retake our core states. That makes it easy, right? Makes it super easy for us. Thank you, thank you. Ah, nice. Uh, Ship-wise, we already have the best subs, so... Just don't make sure that they die. There you go. Fighter threes would be very good too. Any other planes we could throw on our guys? We have a lot of planes in general. Not bad. Oh god, dang it! Oopsie. God dang it! Ah, just. God dang you, piece of garbage! It's so laggy this game sometimes. It makes things just go wonky. There you go. Don't want to deal with it. There you go. There you go. One, two, three, four. Boom. One, two, three, four. They'll fill them out, so I'm not too worried about that. Something like that. Cool. Cass. Good, good. There you go. Nice. Nice. Before we go to war, let's see, you guys are up there, it's fine. There you go. There you go. There you go. Still level 5. 36% uh, of the way there, not bad, not great, but not bad. It's fine, just keep exploring, looking and killing. And, good as well. Better cast. But let's say just in case. We got plenty of manpower, just in case. We got plenty of guns. Uh, we just decked out our air force, or army with an air force. We got a few more railway guns as well. We're looking pretty good overall. As long as Spain isn't just tr continuing to just try to blow us up, we'll be okay-ish. We will be fighting the other people as well, but oh well. Let's see what we can do. Promote fascism there. South America, absolutely. We need at least 40% here. Alright, so be it. We are fighting now the Greater East Asian Corp Prosperity Sphere. See if we can push them any further. Hope we get non aggression back with the British as well. What are the losses like? So, the Polish Empire lost quite, we've lost quite a few. Belgium has 31 divisions, which is not bad. They've lost about a million to the Greater Corp Prosperity Sphere. Yeah, then my destroying national Spain has pissed me off a little bit. Not too much, though. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, they actually got lost quite a few of the Turks for some reason. Russia? Well, we'll get there. Should still be doing relatively okay-ish. Yeah, 11 divisions. We do not have any extra divisions to spare right there, so thank you. Nice, thank you. Uh, we should have absolute air superiority, which I don't understand why we don't have it here. Um, Russia does not have that many planes, thank you. I mean, they're spread out. Like, they're really flipping spread out. They should be, at least. But I could be wrong. Uh, there you go. Do some of that stuff. Because you can, as well. Level 7. Wow. Anything there? What was it? Infiltration? Assault? Yeah. Go well planned attack by you, at least. And infiltration. I think that's the one we were doing, right? Okay, infiltration assault. See what we can do with that one. You guys going too? Oh, they're right there too. Oh crap. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Now we're good. How many men have we lost? To Russia, we've lost not as many yet. But against Russia, we've killed 110,000. Not, not enough yet. Probably should help out the attack there. Looking better already. Well, that's not bad. Claims into China, huh? Oh, we need way more anti-air. Uh, military police? Yeah, why not? Probably release really that. Atomic Physics Institute. We'll expand the Krakow Industries next. Yes, please. Phalangism? Yes. Say yes to Phalangism. And they are only at 23%, which sucks. And you're only at 23%. Oh, you're both at 23%. That's kind of weird, but okay. We can, we can groove that one. 
So the allies going to do anything against the Japanese or not? Kind of dumb they don't do anything. So, supply bases. Any supply bases around here? Oh, we just took Volgograd. Stalingrad. Volgograd. Nice. Good job, guys. Just in case. Looking pretty bad on parts of the front here. Not bad for us, though. Not too bad. We are pushing in just a little bit. We have suffered how many losses? 67,000? Versus 180,000. They are coming in here a little bit more quickly than I would have liked. That's alright. Death of that dude, alright. Cool. They are flooding through, which is really not good, so stop. And reassess. Just hold the line. We're gonna get to St. Petersburg eventually, so. Nice. So level five, not bad. Its infantry divisions are doing okay. How much arty do we have? We have rocket artillery. Ah, throw, throw the arty on here. Actually, this is better now. It makes us a little heavier, less piercing, but at the same time, it gives us just a little bit more push. Supplies should still be okay though, too. You guys should have like no supplies, right? Four million manpower. Not many convoys. Yeah, they got like no infantry equipment. They got some artillery. Not bad. 70,000 people in, working in the Air Force. Not great, but whatever. Yeah, y'all just kind of hang out for now. Honestly, you're taking way too long with these soldiers, so yeah. Screw it, just blend them all. Need you guys up there immediately, and need another eight right here, too. Keep building up those supply bases, or at least supply, period. There you go. Not bad, though. Not bad. Could be better, could be worse, but still. Oh, we got a circle? That's stupid. Bros. Bros. Why do you suck so much? If they want to encircle us, we gotta encircle them, too. So, like, that's only fair. There you go. Go in. They do this crap to us, we do this crap to back right at them. Let him die. Are you kidding me? No. You are, are, we're going to encircle them. Get in there. Come on. Go, 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 go. And attack and kill them off. That's all I want. Good. Kill them off. Kill, 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 kill. Uh, there you go. Honestly, I don't want to be bothered this anymore, so... Uh, what, what's the name of this one? Phalanges Pole and Task Force 4. Phalanges Pole and Task Force 4. 4. And you're what? Empire Task Force 3. There you go. Don't want to deal with it anymore. We are definitely pushing them in, though. Do we take Moscow already? No. We're getting close, though. Close-ish. They have, they have been cut off from Baku, which is nice. We might need to build up another supply base, though. Like here-ish. It's not bad over there. Not bad, not bad. Push them out as far and as fast as we possibly can. Don't worry about attacking, just kind of hang out. it be a lot, lot worse. 36% is not really learning anything now, god dang it. So with us fighting these guys too, the allies should be doing much better here. They should be, but then... Yeah, they are! Look at that! It's a little blue here. Not bad. They don't have a lot of convoys either. Up to 300 maybe max. Oh! They actually did take Okinawa and Iwo Jima. Nice. Yeah, they're definitely coming back with a vengeance. That's nice. Yeah, they're on a two-front war and Russia's on a two-front... Well, maybe it was... Well, it's sort of a two-front war-ish. Any other... Uh, real, yes, yes. Because some of these dinglings already lost a couple railway guns. Ding dongs, ding dongs. Just kind of hold for now. Sala is up there. Oh, the UK was pushing up there too. That's not bad. Thank God we're going to deal with uh, 
a lot of this naval stuff anymore. Just let it set and forget. That's how I like it. And that's how most people like it. Just set and forget and just go. If you can. If you can, of course. Yurolsk. Mm. Yurolsk. Huh. Ooh, more cavalry. Honestly, I don't mind mixing this a little bit more with you guys. Maybe. Let's see. Do we have a cavalry general? No, but this guy's got extra attack, so we'll use him. We'll see. We'll see where he's like. Stanislaw Kopanski. Rocket artillery upgrade. Maybe we'll still use them. Maybe, maybe not. Um. Mm. That's garrisons. Yeah, maybe I'll we'll wait. You guys. It's just not worth using yet. It's not as good as normal cavalry. Oh. Provisional government of the German Reich. Yeah, no, we're good. We, we don't think they, they really need to be out there doing that type of stuff. What are you guys not doing? Yeah, you should be out there completely all the time. Well, at least these guys are cut off, which is nice. We are really pushing into Central Asia on this side here. It's kind of ridiculous. Uh, expand Krakow Universities. Um, uh, modernize Galician Industry. If you want to this one, please go right ahead. Yay! Do we need more guns already? We need more artillery. Which I'm glad we could put more factories on them, but... Obviously, it was not enough. Hmm. It's 44. Grab some of that, too. Oh, we're actually pushing in here, too. Look at that. Well, we're trying. Desperately trying. We've lost how many men against Russia? 200,000. We lost 120,000 versus the Japanese. Uh, we've killed off 320,000 from the Japanese. And for Russia, roughly half a million. Oh, keep pushing in America. Oh, they're trying to take Taiwan. Taiwan? Taiwan as well. Provisation expert. Cavalry person. Nice. Even more speed on that would be great. Moscow is a frontline city, which is awesome. But as we're pushing in, we got to make sure we got more air bases here too, because that's some of our bread and butter right now. A lot of air bases. Oh, and fascism. Fascism? Fascism. Brazil, you're at 26%. Not great, but not bad. We just want more fascism in our lives, that's all. So we've got quite a bit of green here. On you guys a hold. Let everyone get to the line first. Give us a little bit of a break. Get to the line. Enjoy ourselves just a wee bit. I was doing more Seawolf stuff. Just defense level up. Combat warfare. Best of the best. Oh, submarine primacy. Design cost research speed. Eh, that's okay. We're already done researching stuff. Nivok speed gain. Je Hmm. Close combat. Tor torpedo screen combat uh, penetration is pretty good. Positioning is not bad. Bad weather penalty. Visibility goes down even further. Retreat chance. Fleet speed when retreating. Screening bonus when you're only using capital ships. Chance to score critical hits. Hmm. Well, let's do more penetration. And more screen attack. Are subs considered screens? Are they really considered screens? I'm not really sure. The supply base there if you need one. Um, go in there too. Oh, let's go here to there. That should help us out, and then get one down here too, because we, God, we need one. Yeah, if we could build up more you know, railways, that'd be great. Not sure exactly how we would do that, but we could really use more railways. Um, do we max up? Oh, we didn't even max up the torpedoes. Oh, we need to do that, definitely. Yeah, just give us some time to build up our roads. Oh, nice, nice. They're also getting more infrastructure as well. It's very, very good. But we don't need a guard against the UK because hopefully they're not going to kill us off. And we still need more Artie. Oh, good job, guys. You actually took St. Petersburg. Well, look at that. Well, would you look at that. God, I just want Moscow, man. Can we take it, maybe? Yes, no, maybe so. We're doing some damage. It's very nice damage. No? Why are you pathetic? Well, that sucks. That's stupid. Give us some time for so. Keep doing this. 
and more fascismus. Nice, twenty-eight percent is not bad. Oh, and oh god, now they're attacking us. Yeah, that's not good. Pushing us back maybe just a little bit in some select areas like up here and around here, but we're holding out some of the areas too. So, and when they attack us, they're gonna be losing a lot of guys. Oh yeah, 370,000, almost half a million. Yeah, overall not bad. Let them attack us just a wee bit. Oh, they're desperately trying. Ah, supply base is right there. Nincy Novgorod. Ooh, that sucks. Can't quite take it yet, but getting all these extra supply areas here is going to be super, super beneficial, especially down here in the south. And up here. It'll be so nice. And once we get enough supply, we'll push back out, if possible. Up here, it's going to take some time. Ooh, this supply base has been cut off. Yep, well, we lost that one. God dang it, you pieces of doo-doo. Um, did we, were we making one around here, too? I'm more certain that we were. Rocket artillery upgrade, that should help us out a little bit more. Nice. Don't want to try the drone tech yet. I mean, is not that limited, but it's probably good to wait. Except right here. You'll be fine here. I like seeing the... Hello? Are you trapped behind enemy... You're literally trapped behind enemy lines. That's kind of wild. Alright, whatever. Modernized Galician industry. Um... Is that one plan east, maybe? We've been in and out of military conflict with the Russians for centuries, and we can safely assume that Vladimir III and Will, like, like his predecessors, will attempt an invasion of Poland. They must not have succeeded this time. Plans must be uh, made aware, or at least be drawn to ensure Poland's decisive of victory over Russia. Fortification of Ukraine, the east is underdeveloped in Nagarium, and Polish Ukraine remains the south spot in Poland's south prime for invasion. Some basic fortifications must be controlled along the border. We are to keep up with our nation, keep our nation safe. Absolutely. They're still attacking us. I mean... Overall, I mean, they might be pushing it here and there, but it ain't too bad. Overall. Level 2 still. Level 2, dude. Oh, couldn't cut win there. That sucks, bro. There you go. They should be suffering a lot more supply loss than this, honestly. Uh, that's alright with us. Eat up the guns. How is uh, Japan looking? Well, actually, the UK, why did you invade the Russia? Okay, whatever. They're pushing out here slightly more. They've invaded the U Oh, they've actually invaded mainland Japan. Not bad. Ooh. Oh, yeah, they're definitely attacking now. Oh, boy. Shouldn't make enough supply bases. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. My goodness. Kind of wild. Almost 600,000. We got 50% war score participation. That's kind of nuts. And almost half a million. Just for the Japanese alone. We're looking pretty darn good now. Oh, yeah. Supplies looking very good in some of these areas. Thank you, boys. Uh, I think tanks need to go bye bye. That was very good. Very good. Garev. We couldn't win there. What the heck, bros? Uh, maybe more radar? I don't think that's really going to help us out that much, but whatever. Lots and lots and lots and lots of supply. Okay, should be pushing in just a little bit more. Oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely down there, too. Uh, another horse boy? Yes. We could try general attack. I mean, it's going to be really bad for us, but we could try it. Yeah, try it, but with, uh... Let's hang on. There you go. Could become a spy mask, but I want to get uh, some of them southern South American boys in with us. There you go. Fort commit, not bad. Um, special forces, maybe. Mm -hmm. Thirty-one percent. Oh my God! It takes so long to promote ideology down here. It's only point one five as well, so it's not that great. 
Come on. Come on, one more. That's all I'm gonna ask for is one more. Good. Government cyber schools. Nice. We would like to become the spy master, but oh well. Definitely already slowed down. We did take Moscow though. That's pretty nice. 25 divisions, they should be out of equipment. Yeah. Can you guys do anything here? Can we link up here? That'd be really good, actually. We could. I'd love to force the attack, but whatever. We are moving through here too, so you guys are there. There you go. Good luck. Yeah, you guys should definitely be able to push through here and then link up with these guys. Get maybe get rid of the army, we'll see. I don't know. More factories are good. Grab some more um arty. Yeah, I was the one to give us arty. What the heck's wrong with them? There you go. Expand out a little bit more. This is very nice. Keep, keep, keep up the pressure. That good old pressure. Not bad. Is that it? Oh, UK, you are sucking hard. You moved up here, but you lost the territory that you took. America's looking better. Than you guys. Definitely better. Expanded there a little bit more as well. Probably want to finish off the Philippines as well. Overall, not too shabby. Not great, but not too shabby. Uh, more infrastructure, maybe? Just because this does give you a slight bit of supply as well. Build on the road right there. That'd be good. Build right there as well. From there to there. Something like that. Nice. How much more equipment do they have? 3 million manpower, 18 convoys. Um, well, they have a little bit of artillery. No guns, it looks like, which is very, very good. A couple planes, a couple planes here and there. Overall, though, like we're looking pretty good. Poland, when set up correctly, can do quite well. Nice. And that's not bad. Do that one too, just in case. I don't lose any more uh, subs. If possible. Hey, you, actually has a, you guys actually won. Good job. Nice. There you go. Should be good enough, right? Oh, yeah. You are doing it. Yeah, you have the orders for all this territory. Oh boy. 51's good enough. Advanced rocket artillery. Um, logistics, maybe. There you go. Plan East. Uh, local Eastern plans. Often, our own military staff can be trusted to devise plans amongst themselves, but in a world like this, direct intervention on a small scale is necessary. Every inch of ground. Excuse me. Every inch of ground matters. We must apply our expertise to the smallest of conflicts if we are to halt Russian imperialism. That's a lot of divisions around here. Holy crap. Is there anyone okay around here? Because we're about to get to Kazan as well. It's pretty nice. Oh, yeah. Nice. Lost 1.03 million. Japan's about to capitulate, and once Japan leaves, then Russia's got no more support, and then we just push in, and we win. Japan looking pretty sad. Mainland China for them is okay, but... Oh, they've invaded there too. Oh, it's France or the U.S.? Oh. Can't tell, don't care. Five, seven, six, five, five, two. Huh, two. That's sad. Any more railway guns? Maybe. Cavalry, very strong. Move faster. Well, six, not bad. Not too shabby. <sighs> I wish we didn't let him get away with this, but uh, can you just go up there? Because if he could, that'd be great. That'd be amazing if he could, actually. Just cut him off. That'd be awesome. Oh, we could race with the bomb as well. We can allow others to develop an atom bomb before us. We must do whatever we can ensure that our technological superiority is not threatened. So how close are we with this one? We are only 33% of the way there. You guys are 32% of the way there. We don't have enough PP now. Of course, the game's lagging pretty hard at 45, but you know, whatever. Did we take Kazan? Oh, we're close. We're actually, we're very, very close. 
supply base is still being built, which is awesome. Bruh, get, get in there. You take that and you get supply. Eventually, in a couple days. We are all the way balls deep now in uh, Central Asia. Not bad. And allies are really sucking hard. I mean, except for the, I mean, they're doing well against Japan, but like Central Asia or just Asia in general, they're not doing that great. I mean, kind of expected. Never fight a land war in Asia, but still, still. How much more strength does Japan even have? Million manpower. These are looking two to three. They're almost out of convoys. They're running out of fuel-ish, slightly. Not bad much though. Mm, that supply point will be very good. Hey, we got another uh, Volgograd. Is it Volgograd? Where's this one? Uh, let's see over here. Change that one up, that's fine. You guys are fine as well, it looks like, yeah. Good. Very good. Ah, there, yeah, those guys over there too. Oh. Well, they're trapped down there. What do you have? Provisation expert? Alright, infantry expert, sure, why not? Because we can. Floating harbor, I guess. Might as well make one. Oh, 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 oh. Well, that one's almost done. Might as just keep going with this one. Can we? Can we not? There we go. Actually. Lower stability and war support. Boost. Oh, there we go. Oh, we could probably do that one. Yeah, let's do that one, maybe. So we need to do this, and then we gotta do this. Yeah. Because we need more daily patches if we want to flip them. If we have enough time to. So 0.57 jumps up to what? 0.62. So 0 0.05. We need to get to 40%. We, might, we still might not be able to get up there in time. Gosh dang it. Local Eastern plans. Because I do want to do this one. The Americas are full of full alliance movements, mainly across the Latin American countries. Expanding your alliance into the Americas is not necessarily, is necessarily not only to secure our fellow alliance's interests worldwide, but protest, protect our fellow, fellows from American influence. Not a bad idea. Of course, I'd like to invite the Baltics, and as majority Catholic nations are at risk of Bolshevik invasion, the Baltics are natural allies to the Falange's cause and must be protected. Um, Belarusian army, Eastern conscripts, fortification of the north. This north side of the Eastern Poland is littered by a series of dense forests with scarcely a trace of civilization amongst them. This cannot continue so to be so in the event of an invasion. These forests must be transformed into shield against Bolshevism. Hey, Ornberg. I've heard of Ornberg. I don't think they have content yet, but whatever. We're still doing okay here. Um, keep doing them. That'd be nice. Magnet detonators are very good to get. Very, 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 very strong. That's repeat of reveal chance, even better. Who's going to capitulate first? Russia or... No, nope, Japan already capitulated. I didn't realize it. 6% of the way there, and then we'll have them done. Which kind of sucks. You guys keep pushing out that way. That'll be fine. So the Commonwealth states, the Commonwealth states of America, and then UK, and then France. Oh, they all wanted to get their little slice of the pie here. Where are you at, Brazil? That sucks. Um, don't waste your time up here. With those pesky allies. Yeah, we might just go with this one anyway. Let's just immediately do it. Yeah. Polish Empire and bots us to the Polonis International. Let's go and do that one. It's fine. They gotta give up soon, right? Are we over these guys too? Agent Oh god dang it. How am I supposed to rescue him? There you go, do that. Still, only 36... Are they go? Is it going back down? 0 0.23? 0 0.238? Oh, no, it's still going up, but it's just... It's barely going up at all. Just like us trying to take out these guys, too. Oh, my goodness, please, hurry up. 95% of the way there. So stupid. What do we need? They don't even have... They don't even own Vladivostok. That, that's ridiculous. Nuclear reactors are nice, though. Wait, I like it when things go boom. A little bit ahead of time. Mm. Mm. 
Engineers, because we can. Go, 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 go. Um, house supply. Not great. But not bad in some areas. Not bad. Alright. Alright, so 95%. 96, we got a whole 1% more. Wow, that's not just jolly. Make sure we're gonna splat here anyways, too. That'd be good. We're literally in Siberia now, and we still cannot just capitulate them. When every single major city of theirs has been taken out. So, I think this is really stupid. How balls deep do we have to go? Or how much further will we have to go? Another horse boy's not bad. I don't get rid of you. I prefer the horses for now. Yes, yes. Our diplomatic mission to Italy. If we're to convince its other nations to join the Intermarium, we must convince them it is in their best interests. We're sending Joseph Beck on diplomatic missions. We stand a much better chance of building the defensive alliance we could dream of. Well, we're gonna take out the Italians, so it's probably a little late for them to agree to us, so I have a feeling that's the case. I could be wrong. But I have a pretty god darn good feeling that they don't want to join us. Oh, hello, where do we get flung to? Now let's try to get this guy. Oh, auto saving. Darn it, I was gonna lag so hard there that we get a uh, win. Um, I don't want you anymore. Thanks for playing, guys. Hmm. That wouldn't be bad, but we're still doing okay with whatever we have right now. Law says 1.16. We haven't taken that many more casualties. We've killed off oh, quite a few Russians. We've done it. Only 2% more needed. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. There we go. That's better. Nice. She insisted. Good. Last one. And... We're not going to be able to get them. 38% is not enough. We're not even 38% yet. My god. That's so stupid. Like, it has to be faster than that. We've got to find some sort of way to be faster than that. Um... Supplies got off here too. What, 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 what the hell are you doing up here? I was like, where are the divisions? Why do you have 60 divisions just sucking supply? If you want to suck something, go suck your dad. But, like, bro, why are you wasting time over there? Wait, you need to go Should be 99% now. But we're not. No, now we are, though. Now we are. Yeah, pretty sad. Uh, it looks like we're not going to be able to piece out with the national Spanish, but whatever. Even, though, even India and Canada is considered major power. Oh my goodness. The oh, Philippines are about to die again. Mexico is considered major power. Oh boy. They haven't done anything. They got more Taiwan. They, took, they went to Central Asia. Or not Central Asia, but Continental Asia. What the heck? Now they're invading Korea. Oh my god, please take a lot of stock. I guess it won't really matter they did that, but whatever. Whatever. No, I don't you either right now. Sorry. We're done with you guys. Upgrade's good to medium. Of course, that's going to hurt supply issues by throwing more guys on the line, but whatever. Alright, the Dominican Republic has accepted the Invitational. Venezuela's joined. Peru's joined. El Salvador. Alright, well, at least we've got some people. That sucks. I mean, why 40%? I get why we need to do 40%, but at the same time, honestly, like, you should be able to invite them in later on. Maybe there's a way that we can invite them in later on. That'd be really nice. Oh, we won! But, you know, there should be a way to do it later on. Can we invite them into our faction? Why did they not capitulate? Who is a major power now? Please don't tell me it's China. Oh my god, I hate this so much. Ah, uh, we're done here. We're done. Um, honestly, this looks pretty good. I'm not gonna wait to take out Guangxi clique just because that's incredibly stupid. But hey, if you enjoy the campaign, 
That's so stupid. Uh, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great, great rest of your day.